Hello everyone, it's been a long time since I've done any unboxing videos, but let's check it out today. It's, it has been a really long time. I apologize for that, in a way. I have picked up one and a half times more job. Uh, not as many hours, I guess, but we lost someone at work, so, well, someone's got to cover it. So that's me and other people, but me. Let's take a look at what I got today. Should be packaged from Yes Asia. They've been really good to me lately. This came in a nine day period since I ordered, which is not very long at all for them. <laughs> got their customs quickly, I guess. Here's my little shipping manifest. I got, let's go through it. Gain and, uh, what's his name again? Hyung Woo. It's a mini album duet. Romantic Spring. Hold up. I got Dalshabet's BBB. Honestly, I thought I ordered this uh, sign from someone else. I cannot remember. I also had a couple beers a moment ago. We'll see. <laughs> and here is um, Tiara's Temptastic, which is their second mini. Um, released in 2000. 10, 11, 11, I think. This is reissued recently, so it's a little more. Yeah, this was reissued in 2013, but it's a 2010 um, production. Let's go with the most relevant um, new release, which is Dalshabets. Let's open that up. It was not Dalshabet that I ordered signatured. My bad. <laughs> it was another group. See, Dalshabet, Girls' Day, and Rainbow Blacks all released something uh, sexy recently. And I got Rainbow Blacks signed. We'll see that whenever it gets here. Let's alter the angle here. I wish I could boost my lighting. Let's do this. My new apartment isn't as good as well lit. And, well, let's take a look. As you can see, the cover is slightly, I mean, it's slightly reflective, very reflective at certain angles because it has this mirror silver border background. It's pretty smooth. It's kind of, uh, I don't know how to call it. It's solid. I like it. Um, better than others, at least. <laughs> here's the track, li oh, look, it's me. <laughs> Um, here's a track listing on the back. Rewind, BBB, something, uh, someone solo, featuring BTOB. I can't read the fourth title. BBB Remix and BBB Instrumental. Big Baby Baby. Let's open it up here. Oh, hold on. Here's the spine. Very similar to the rest. Also, this is new to me, but I'm not the biggest Dal Shabet fan. I have a couple other albums, three of them so far. But the symbol... I don't, I've not seen it before, but it's pretty cool. All right, so let's open it, let's open it up. Here's the album. It's kind of a maroon color. Um, let's see if I can get an angle on that to show the color well. There we go. Um, maroon is this hometown of mine's uh, team color, so this place in well. Plays well with the SIU Salukis. Go Salukis! <laughs> I honestly don't care. Behind that you have the different girls here. I know some of them. I have not mastered my Dalshabet knowledge. Um, this looks like Jiul. Uh, <laughs> I give up. I give up early. Sorry. Let's go through this um, booklet here. It's an not the thickest, but it's a decent size, I guess. It's their seventh mini album, which I am grossly mistaken on. I thought this was like their fifth or fourth. <laughs> um, seven mini albums is a lot. Here we go. All the different girls. Track listings again. Dalshabet went the sexy route this time, as opposed to, you know, they kind of had a quirky route before um, in their other promotions. You can look at their mini albums that they have released that I may have videoed, including um, Super Duper Diva, 
Supa Dupa Diva, rather. Um, I mean, that had, like, weird, really flowery outfits and bunny ears. It was odd. <laughs> oh, what does this say? I'm having trouble reading I think that says Dal Shabet, but I'm having trouble reading it. I think the seams are too well done. Okay, next page. Yeah, it does say Dal Shabet, just in a certain font. That is Wuhi. This is Sari. Uh, in the earlier promotion, she had really red hair. That's how I told her apart. Was able to tell her apart. This is Gan. 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 She's in a bathtub. Looks like fake water, too, but. <laughs> Here's this Ayong. Might be Ayong. I am actually not sure how to pronounce that. Here's Jiul. Or Jiul. I can't pronounce that well. I should really take some Korean lessons from my customer. <laughs> he offered. Here is Subin. She's the main vocal, is what Casey told told me. And here they are in an outfit change here. This is bad. I don't know who's who. And they all have different hair colors too to help me out. This is Jewel. Okay. I think I like Jewel from the other earlier albums. I'm just having trouble recognizing them now. <laughs> it's been the earlier albums are really kind of old though at this point. Subin. Khan. I like her hair here. That dress is questionably distasteful. <laughs> Take a look. It's all holes. Siri. Siri had the really high cheekbones and kind of the rounder face. Um, that's how I remember her. Wuhi was a newer member. She replaced uh, Vicky when Vicky, the leader, um, decided to leave. I don't know the backstory behind that, but Wuhi's the newer member. Aeyong, Aeyong, something. Um, here we go. More pictures of Aeyong. Here we go with the lyrics. Rewind. Uh, looks like a full track, which is good. I'm tired of intros. <laughs> Big Baby Baby. BBB. And the rest of the tracks I can't really say. And here is the staff page and another picture of the girls. As well as all the websites you should visit if you can read any Korean. <laughs> I cannot. And that looks like it concludes this album, Big Baby Baby. Uh, yeah. I like kind of like Dolce, but they're really growing on me as opposed to the first time I tried to get into them, it didn't work. Um, so they have been growing on me. This is their newest album, 2013, the beginning of it. Big Baby, or 2014, I'm sorry. This is um, Big Baby Baby. Uh, released in January-ish. So yeah. Alright, I'm gonna end this video and go on to one of these other ones. If you have any questions, leave me a comment below. Otherwise, I hope you have a good day.